Now geysers are incredible volcanic related features. In fact, these are the ones on top of the super volcano in Wyoming. And they typically throw hot or boiling water up into the air. And it's a remarkable sight. Indeed, there are a few places on Earth where you can actually see them. And one of the most popular places is Yellowstone. So the way it typically works is water goes down into the hot earth where it gets boiled at some point, and the pressure of that actually throws the water up into the air. And one of the most popular geysers in the park is Old Faithful, not because it's the biggest, but because it's one of the biggest reliable geysers, blowing off about once an hour or so. Now, as it turns out, I got lots of thermal video in Yellowstone. Partly because it's amazing just to see where the earth is hot and the such like. And secondly, because the park really didn't seem to have made any effort to take any thermal video itself. Sadly, I'm currently living out the back of a car and editing video is significantly more difficult than normal. So for the moment, I'm just going to give you Old Faithful in the infrared. And this is maybe one of the most interesting things to look for here, is what do you think is going to be hottest? The first water that comes out of the geyser or the last? Enjoy. There we go. Who would have thought it? The war at the end is the hottest. And if you want a teaser for what's up next. Entering the sand point. There we go. And of course, reflections. Do you think reflections is going to be a problem here? Do you think that there's going to be a problem with reflections? With solar roadways? So, it must be said that for what is essentially a half million dollar installation there, um, no expense was spared on the, on the display cabinet. Uh, yeah, I mean, it's hardly any wonder this thing caught fire. Obviously, they got the same people who made the roads to uh, make the box. Another defects, and of course, the workmanship is absolutely crap. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely pathetic workmanship. And uh, the world's most secure lock. And of course, it's not, oh my God, it's not even weatherproofed. That one's dead. Right, he's not doing anything. Maybe he's marine plywood or something. It's all cracking down the back here. Held on by the looks of things by a single screw. The whole thing is held on by a single screw.
outstanding. Outstanding.